I'm Mary Reddick here for CaptainSoup.com and we're going to talk about some different fatty acids today. The difference between olive oil versus lamb tallow and why you might want to use one over the other. Whenever I put someone on a very deep, a deep protocol, let's say they have a lot of healing to do, they've got MS, they're in a wheelchair or uh, they really want to speed up the healing process, I actually take out all plant fats from their diet, even healthy ones like olive oil and coconut oil. Now these are traditional healthy fats, it's not that no one should be eating them. Them. I actually bring them back into the diet after a few weeks or a few months, depending on the test case. But the, the animal fat, the fatty acid profile from things like lamb, from salmon, from grass-fed beef tallow, is so ideal and perfect for rebuilding our human cells that I tend to go for that first. Our human cells should be like sponges. They should be soft and excellent at communicating with the rest of the body, taking in and out nutrients, the communication from insulin. And unfortunately, a lot of the seed oils that many of us were brought up on, especially the, the processed seed oils that we had in our kitchens and in restaurants, can make our cells very rigid. So one thing I like to do is immediately take out everything from the plant kingdom as far as fats go and put in the animal fats so that we can rebuild that tissue, get that communication cycle going very well. And then once that, once we're seeing evidence of that, then we'll bring back in the olive oil and use that liberally. Same with the coconut oil, the sustainable palm oil, and those wonderful plant fats in addition. But I never will take someone off the animal fats just to the plant. I don't tend to see the same kind of healing. You can play with this on your own and see if you see the same kind of results. One thing I ask many of my patients to do is actually to add extra fat to their bowls of soup, so don't hesitate to do that. Feel free to add an extra scoop of tallow to your soup today. All right, this is Mary Reddick coming live for CaptainSoup.com. Please click like, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one.